Yo guys, it's Book of Ball here, and today is actually a very special day. Of course, I'm in the past, but as soon as this video comes out, Captain America Civil War just came out. Now, as you're watching this video, I'm actually seeing Captain America Civil War, but I'm probably like at Jake's house at the time, and we're just heading to the movie theaters, because usually when we see movies, it's like around 7 to 8, and apparently Austin has plans this weekend for me. So apparently like since he didn't come to my house during my birthday weekend, he decides to do it this weekend. So he's going to give me a present which is apparently a new mouse pad. So, so if you guys don't know my peripherals right now, my peripherals right now is actually just a normal Logitech keyboard. It's not really fancy or anyway. And also my Logitech MS Maxer mouse which is absolutely amazing i really love this mouse but this is my mouse pad and apparently i'm getting one of those like long mouse pads that just like covers up my keyboard and my mouse so that i can just have like really normal mouse pad and it would also cover up these lines right here you can't tell but there's actually lines it's actually like lines that cut in here that's why this wire seems to be like wireless like this thing is like stuck to it you can't really like pull it out but there's actually lines here that I hide my wires and also the keyboard as well. So guys, what do you think I'm actually going to be repping? I don't know if I want to rep Team Iron Man because like Iron Man seems like the person that wants to stop the Avengers and Captain America is the type of person that wants to save the Avengers. Now, I really do like Iron Man, but Captain America is apparently right in some ways. I mean, of course you cause a lot of destruction, but you're actually saving the world from destruction. Iron Man, all I like him is just for his money and his suit. I mean, he's, I mean, who wouldn't want to be Iron Man? Who wouldn't want to wear a suit and just fly around and have money and do a bunch of women and stuff like that? And in Iron Man's team, he has a bunch of characters, including my all-time favorite Marvel hero, Spider-Man. Of course, it's not Deadpool. I mean, Deadpool is a really cool Marvel character, but I've always loved Spider-Man as a kid. Like, I even have a Spider-Man jacket, like, Somewhere over there, I have a Spider-Man jacket. It's one of those like hoodies that you can just like zip up all the way and then just act like Spider-Man. They even have Black Panther, which he is new to the Marvel Cinematic Universe and he is apparently one of the richest heroes in the Marvel Universe. Actually, in the whole entire comic series. He's even richer than Batman, Iron Man, and Oliver Queen, which is the Green Arrow combined. And the reason why he has so much money is because of vibranium. His claws are made out of like stainless vibranium that you can't even break. It can even, I don't know if it can kind of break the Captain America shield, but it's like, it's one of the richest metals that he's selling in his own island. Apparently he has his own island and he's just like selling vibranium and he's like, now one of the richest people, which is why he has such an amazing suit. And the only person that I like from Captain America's team would probably have to be Falcon, Ant-Man, Falcon. Falcon just flies and he just beats up people. Freaking Ant-Man just can grow and shrink and just destroy everything. Plus, his new suit looks amazing. I mean, I would like to recreate the Ant-Man suit, but like, I just don't really know how to make the Ant-Man suit. But I do want to rep Team Captain America, which is why I also have Captain America shirts. I have a plain old Captain America and one with just like his metallic shield that I think that's big on me because it's large. I don't have any Marvel hats. All I have is just a Batman and Superman hat. So I might just go to the movie theaters with my Captain America shirt and also my Dead Mouse hat. So it's just gonna be like a normal like attire, just me with a comic book shirt and with my normal Dead Mouse hat. But it's actually gonna be lit because after the movie is over, we're going to a restaurant called Chewy's. Now, Chewy's is basically a Mexican restaurant. I've never been there before, but I do love Mexican food. So in about a few minutes, I'm actually gonna be checking what's on the menu so that I know what to order when I get there, or maybe just look at the menu when I get there and then see what I want, cause me and Mexican food, um, yeah, we're going in. And then we're probably doing other stuff on Saturday, but we have no idea what to expect. So that's it for this commentary. Hope you guys enjoy, and hope you guys have a good Captain America day. See you guys later. Come on out.